is sort of pulling this music out of the, um, the, the threads of history and, and weaving it into the tapestry of our, of our 21st century lives. Leonora Duarte was a Portuguese converso Jew living and working in Antwerp in the 17th century. It's just really great music, wonderful music, and with a strong personality. Most of it has not been recorded before. It probably would not have been played in a concert setting. Her music was most likely played for friends and family, and by friends and family. There's one manuscript that survives. It's at Christ Church College, Oxford, and it's probably in the hand of Gaspar Duarte, Leonora's father. I love thinking about this, the fact that her father took the time to write out his daughter's music, to preserve it for posterity. I'm so excited about sharing this music by a female composer from the 17th century. There is an element of gravitas that I find so compelling. When I uh, perform or play Duarte's music, I think of its immortality, and I think of how it's so relevant even now. This recording is a very, very special project for us. Our collaborator for this project is the New York Times Magazine photography critic and writer, Teju Cole. Teju's spoken prose and photography will anchor our dialogue with Duarte and preserve her memory for generations to come. I'm Elizabeth Weinfield, and I'm the artistic director of Synabula. I'm James Kennelly, and I play the harpsichord and sing. My name is Jude Ziliak, and I play the violin. My name is Amy Dominguez. I play the viola da gamba, and I'm a founding member of Synambula. My name is Shirley Hunt. I play viola da gamba. My name is Tomai Liev, and I play the violin. We're very excited about this project, and we'd love to have your help. We would love it if you could help us with this project. <laughs> we accept coconuts, shekels, yen, macaroni.